Hey there everybody, I thought I would do a, a little test between my MacBook Pro 13.3 inch and my iMac. The iMac is an i7 3.4 gigahertz with 8 gigs of RAM. I believe it has a 1 terabyte hard drive and they're, both system, systems are running line, so the latest version of line. Um, the MacBook Pro is a, a 2.3 gigahertz Intel Core Duo and of course the iMac is the quad core so I'm thinking it ought to be twice as fast of course it's got double the RAM so I don't know maybe a little bit more than twice as fast but uh, I'm fixing to click this is um, done with Geek, Geekbench 64-bit version you can get it off the web uh, it's pretty cool um, First I'm going to click on the MacBook Pro and see what kind of settings we get with it. There's the settings as you can see. Let's see if I can get a little closer get this chair out of the way. Alright, there's the settings on the MacBook Pro, let's run it and just see what kind of score we get. Um, it gives you all kinds of scores on all kinds of things that it tests, but uh, most people won't even know what half of them are, so there's no point in even trying to explain them. I probably won't even know what some of them are, I'm sure, too. All right, there's the scores of 6,443. Oops, and I accidentally hit it to do it again. Let's see. Let's get that out of the way. As you can see, uh, there's all the settings. Four megs of RAM, 320 gig hard drive, 2.3 gigahertz, Intel Core Duo. There's all the stats, which or be meaningless to most of you. But anyway, that's that's not a bad score. 6,443 for the MacBook Pro. Now let's check out the iMac. Let's go up here. As you can see, uh, it's this both both of them are the 64-bit version. It's i7, 3.4 gigahertz, quad core. And let's just click on it and run it and see what we'll get on it. Okay, now let's run the iMac and see what we get. I would think it'd at least be double. But you know, who knows? This iMac I just got like about a month ago, if that long ago. Alright, there's the score, 12,897, which is really good. As you can see, uh, 8 gigs of RAM. They're both DDR3 RAM. And there's all the stats for uh, the iMac. Let's see if we can back up a little bit. I'm not even sure if it's all on the screen, but hopefully it is. But anyway, I just wanted to do a little comparison. As you can see, the iMac scored really high, 1287. That's about double, so... You'd think with more RAM it would be a little higher, but uh, hey, I'm not complaining. It's pretty good. Um, anyway, I appreciate you watching. Leave me comments and let me know what your scores were and your stats so I can compare mine to yours and you can compare yours to mine. Anyway, thanks for watching this video.